Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, green and uh, yellow circles uh, tangent to each other, whereas uh, this uh, blue circle uh, intersects uh, both of these uh, circles. As you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the area of this uh, green circle is 256 uh, pi centimeter square, and the area of this uh, blue circle is 144 pi centimeter square. The center for green circle is A, the center for yellow circle is B, whereas the center for this blue circle is O. And now our task is to calculate the area of this yellow circle. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, green uh, circle. Let's go ahead and calculate the radius uh, of this uh, circle. And now let's recall the area of a circle formula. Area equals to pi r square. And in our case, the radius of this green circle is 256 uh, pi. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So we got uh, 256 uh, pi equal to pi r square and here pi and pi cancel each other out so therefore r square turns out to be equal to 256 let's undo this uh, square by taking a square root uh, on uh, both uh, sides so therefore our radius uh, turns out to be 16 centimeter so therefore the radius of this uh, green uh, circle uh, turns out to be uppercase uh, r equals to 16 and here's our next step now let's focus on this uh, blue circle we are going to calculate uh, its uh, radius uh, and uh, the area for this uh, blue circle is 144 pi and here's the area of a circle formula let's go ahead and fill in the blanks so we can write uh, 144 pi equal to pi r square and we can see pi and pi cancels out so we ended up with the r square equals to 144 let's undo this uh, square by taking a square root uh, on both uh, sides so therefore our radius uh, for this blue circle turns out to be positive 12 so therefore the radius uh, for this uh, blue circle uh, turns out to be 12 centimeter so therefore the diameter for this uh, circle is going to be twice uh, as this uh, radius so it's going to be 24 so thus the diameter dc of this uh, blue circle is going to be 24 and here's our next step i have removed this uh, blue circle since we just needed uh, this uh, length uh, dc which turns out to be 24 and now let's go ahead and calculate the radius uh, of this uh, yellow circle let me represent uh, this uh, radius of yellow circle by lowercase uh, r and here in this uh, next step i have connected uh, these uh, centers with their respective uh, tangent points and now let's recall the circle theorem according to this theorem the angle between the radius uh, and the tangent uh, will always be 90 degrees as you can see in this uh, diagram these are our radii and this is our tangent line so no wonder these angles are going to be 90 degrees each and now in this uh, next step i have connected uh, these uh, centers and now let's recall this uh, crucial factor the centers and the point of uh, tangency are uh, collinear in other words uh, these are our uh, centers and this point is our point of tangency and uh, according to this uh, fact uh, all uh, these uh, points uh, lie on the very same line and now we know that this is the radius uh, of this uh, green uh, circle which is uh, 16 and the radius uh, of this uh, yellow circle is lowercase uh, r so therefore this uh, a b length uh, is going to be 16 plus lowercase r furthermore uh, this is the radius of the green circle so this is going to be 16 and this is the radius of the yellow circle so it's going to be lowercase uh, r and in this uh, next step i have drawn uh, this perpendicular uh, eb that is uh, parallel to this uh, line uh, dc and in this uh, rectangle uh, ebcd 
this uh, side length uh, DC is equal to this side length uh, EB. So therefore, uh, this uh, EB length uh, is going to be 24. And furthermore, uh, this whole uh, length uh, is uh, 16. And this uh, length uh, is same as uh, this uh, length. So this is lowercase r. So therefore, this uh, tiny length uh, AE is going to be 16 minus r. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, tiny right triangle AEB. And we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem to solve for lowercase r. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. Let me go ahead and call this longest leg as our side c. I'm going to call this side a and this side uh, lowercase b. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. a in our case is 24. So this become 24 square plus uh, b in our case is uh, 16 minus r whole square equal to c in our case is uh, 16 plus r whole square. So let's go ahead and simplify 24 square is going to be 576 plus. And now let's recall this famous identity a minus b whole square could be written as a square minus 2ab plus b square. We are going to apply it on this binomial. So therefore this is going to give us 256 minus 32r plus r square equals to and now let's recall another identity a plus b whole square could be written as a square plus 2ab plus b square we are going to apply it on the right hand side so therefore this is going to give us 256 plus 32r plus r square now we can see this r square and r square is gone 256 and this 256 is gone as well so therefore we are ended up with the 576 minus 32 r equals to 32 r. Now let's go ahead and add 32 r on both sides. This is gone. So therefore if we add the right hand side that's going to give us 64 r equal to 576. And now let's divide both sides by 64. This is gone. So therefore our radius uh, r turns out to be 9 uh, centimeter. So therefore the radius uh, of this uh, yellow circle uh, turns out to be 9. And here's our final step. We figured out the radius uh, of this uh, yellow circle as uh, 9 uh, centimeter. And now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, yellow circle. And now let's recall once again the area of a circle formula area equal to pi r square in our case our r is 9 so therefore the area of this uh, yellow circle uh, is going to be pi times uh, 9 whole square and if we simplify this thing the area is going to become uh, 81 pi centimeter square so thus the area of this uh, yellow circle turns out to be 81 pi centimeter square thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye